Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to be reviewing Big City Greens Season 3 Episode 19B and it's called Funny Farming. Yeah, and I'm going to keep the intro short, but I just want to get this out of the way. I know I said I would post the second half yesterday along with the first half, but I got, I just got really tired and... I, I, I just honestly just gonna honestly say that I just wasn't up to doing it so I'm doing it today and I'm kind of hoping that I'll be able to do episode 20 maybe today also or at least my mini review since it's a season 3 finale I, I want to do a mini review of it of episode 20 didn't actually do the real re the long review and then do a community post after so I think I'll get like the mini mini review done today, but probably save the big review for tomorrow, since I'm doing the second half of episode nineteen today. So yeah, you know, hopefully you guys are excited for that. Um, so let's see. So yeah, I'm doing Bunny Farm today. I'm gonna do the mini review for the season three finale episode twenty today, and um, tomorrow will be the big review and community post. Yeah, uh, let's see, the taste Thursday, so episode 20 will be on Friday, so, let's, it tastes Thursday, right, I, I, want, I want to see if I have the right, oh, the days mixed up, <laughs> I am so sorry, um, <laughs> today is Friday, oh my goodness, um, I, uh, sorry, sorry, but that's my bad on my part. Just, um, it, just my family and I had like different events for different days, and it got like turned around or something for this week. It was only for this week. It was, it was <laughs> sorry, it got like the days mixed up. Oh my goodness. Um, so today's Friday. My bad. Um, so Saturday is going to be the season three finale, and then Sunday. I would say, I think I can do both. Hmm. Yeah, I, I yeah, I, I think I could do both. I'm just trying to um, think of, of like, which one should I do first? Um, should I um, do the, the channel update where I like share like, the merchandise I got from Universal and um, Myrtle Beach? Or should I just do the... Uh, you know, what I think, uh, oh, what I think is going to happen in Big City Green season four, because I, I will look back at my calendar and season four is going to premiere late September, not the last week of September, but like, like, like the week before that. So it's, it's like around there. So yeah, it's, it, it's not like right around the corner, but it's coming up. It's coming up. So I, I mean, I can save the big city greens for season four. I can probably save that for September. So I can just focus on the merchandise of what I got. I can save that, save that for Sunday. Then next week um, is the week where I'm going like, to try to get into the ghost of Molly McGee. Because I actually saw a of the one person who voted. Again, the polls meant for, for, meant for everyone. You could just check there of what show I should review first. And right now, 100% is at the ghost of and Molly McGee. Uh, season 2A. So, like, you know, um, for July, I believe it was Secrets of Sulphur Springs Season 3A. Now, August is the Ghost of Molly McGee Season 2A, but that can always change. Secrets of Sulphur Springs and Big City Greens are both on there. But I understand if you guys don't want to vote for Big City Greens just because I'm literally finishing it up in, like, the next two days. So, that I can totally understand why you guys wouldn't vote for that because I'm just, I'm just going to get it done anyway, so... It, that's totally fine but yeah there's a poll is open for anyone you could just go into the, the the community tab place the vote there you can give it a thumbs up you can even put a comment there and it's and you can even suggest uh, in the comments because i know i i've explained this probably a billion times but the, the comment section on regular videos um that in my in my reviews um unless it's like something for like age 13 and older but my regular reviews uh, on shows and stuff um after like a week or so i put like the 
um, like you know, the restriction that it's like made for kids so kids only, so it can so remain kid friendly, so kids can watch. Because yeah, I want everyone to watch so, Yeah, um, but the community posts should the comments should be like good like obviously it should still remain appropriate so please if you put you know comments please make sure it remains appropriate but anyone can look like there's no like time limit for it there's no time limit for comments i'm not gonna put like a restriction on it like a week later I i'm doing that as a precaution looking like, for for kids and stuff on my videos but for community posts like if, if you have a suggestion even if you have a suggestion for a show and you miss like the time limit on like you know of the, of the comments the community post is open. You can put a comment there. Hey, it, it, um, I highly re recommend that you you put a Disney show because I already tried reviewing a show from, uh, on Netflix. It just it didn't work. And Cartoon Network, I think it tried. Uh, no, not Cartoon Network. Nickelodeon, I tried one time. It didn't work. So, preferably Disney. So if you have a show suggestion, yeah, I can go check it out. But anyway, um. Let's see, was there anything else I wanted to talk about before I begin? I promise they'll keep this intro short, so hopefully I kept that promise, but I'm not sure. Um, let's see. Oh, right. I have received 197 subscribers, so thank you so much to my 197th subscriber. And yeah, I just got a subscriber recently, so thank you so much. I think... Sorry, I thought I heard something. Um, so, so thank you so much to my new subscribers, my current subscribers, my su subscribers that have come on and off the channel. I appreciate you guys. My new viewers, I appreciate you. My original viewers, my current viewers, viewers that have come off the, on and off the channel. And just check out my mini reviews and my community posts and, and just, you know, the, just like, you know, my reviews in general. I really appreciate you guys so much. So thank you. Okay, so without further ado, let's get on with the review. All right, let's see. Oh, oh I also... I don't have a clip. Sorry, so just had to look at my boring <laughs> backdrop, but eh, thing it do. All right, um, let's see. Um, all right. So we first start is everyone you're know, just like working on the farm and everyone working together and um. Apparently, we haven't been in the country um, that long, and again, the timeline in Big City Greens is like a mystery. There's no like one coherent timeline, just, uh, I, I, one, because it's difficult, and two, they just decide to do that, and you just can't complain too much, or you're just not going to like the show, so, but uh, you think you could, they were probably in the country for at least, like, you know, like, like, you think for like a while, but I I think they're only been there for a couple of weeks, like two weeks. They said they said like this is like the, like the uh, first full harvest um that that they done, and it's like a huge farm. But this is like the first harvest. Like you you, you think they would have been there longer for that? I, I'm not complaining or anything. I just think hmm, well that's that, that's interesting. Anyway. <laughs> So it's it's a full harvest and, and um and you know Bill say oh you love love the carrots they look great the cabbages and tomatoes and 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 the bunnies the bunnies and of course Bill hates pests and like oh he she's trying to shoot the bunnies and then and then like you know, oh get out of here your farm is and then Nancy comes in it's only because Bill the bunnies and so like, oh, don't worry I just I took care of them Nancy said, don't worry it's a couple of bunnies nothing to get too high circle on I said okay good Bill's trying to, he's keeping a cool head good. When Bill's flaws that I hate is that he's too over dramatic. It's annoying. But um Nancy like no. Um d d um do you remember Nancy like, do you remember that um corporation that took the farm away from you and the one that tried to feed the dairy cows from? And Bill's like, Yes, Nancy <laughs> I can't remember. The thing that ruined my life. She's like, Yes, I remember. And um she didn't say exactly like that. she didn't say exactly like that, but it's, it's kinda of funny. Um but um, and Nancy says, well, with that same corporation, they put in, like, a new defense system for bunnies. Like, the same bunny, little bunny issue from, from here and there we're having. Well, they're having, like, a bigger trouble there. So, they put a new security se section, a uh, security system, and all the bunnies are going to the nearest farm. And guess what, which farm that is? Bill's like, oh, that's my farm. That's my farm. And then Bill's like, oh, my goodness, what are we going to do? And it's like, B the bunnies are just going to rampage through it, chew through all my crops, and, and 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 if something bad happens to the crops, then everything we worked for 
it will be gone. And even Bill doesn't even say this, but then they will just have to move back to Big City because they won't have like, enough money to keep the farm going. And that's like the whole cycle that happened. What was going to happen with Bill's mom, with Alice, that happened to Bill before, and now it's probably going to happen again. I'm like, she, she, she. In the comments, uh, the, to, to, uh, my, my regards to all farmers out there and all urban farmers, I, I, I give my kudos to all you guys have to deal with these trials and tribulations. Like, my goodness, this cycle. And probably for even, like, your generation farmers. And you're probably some of you guys are just, like, your one generation. But probably some of you are multi-generation. My, my, my kudos tip in my hat to all of you people. Like, seriously, I, I couldn't imagine. It, my family, um, like, down line, like, past generation had, like, some farms, but there weren't, like, major farmers or anything like that. And obviously, like, in my generation, I, I, I'm not even sure, like, I've been to, like, a farm, like, a legitimate farm. So, I had, like, no experience in that area or whatever. So, I just tip in my hat to you guys, like, seriously. But, uh, jeez. <laughs> um, but, uh, b b besides that, uh... Jeez, I'm losing track. Um, all right. So, so you know, Bill's basically kind of worried, and, and then um, and, and basically Bill says we go, we're gonna have to harvest everything today, like today. And then says like, Papa, a harvest is huge. It takes us one week. I was like, oh, geez, I, I mean, again, I never ran a farm before, but I would think this a harvest this huge would take like a whole month, no a week. I'm impressed. I'm impressed with the greens, but they're gonna have to do everything today. Like my goodness, <laughs> my goodness. Ugh, go away. Ignore that, Microsoft. <laughs> anyway, um, Gee, things are just so distracting. Um, uh, right. So, so Bill says we're just had the the harvest everything today, and obviously the, the kids are worried. And Nancy's like, "Do I got an idea? Do you guys start? I, I I'm gonna I'm gonna go." Get something to help, and then I was like, okay, go hire an answer. And Bill, Tilly, and Craig are trying to come up with a plan. Uh, and, and a few minutes go by, um, I, like not like five to ten minutes, it, it wasn't that long. And the bunnies are starting to, starting to come. Oh, geez, and well, where's Nancy with that backup? Or, or like, they don't know about backup, but like Nancy could do something to get help or something. And then Nancy on a motorcycle, she's just getting everybody, uh, like you know, she gets the town, like she gets Dwayne, um. She, the, Wayne, uh, she gets Patty, uh, she gets Good Old Joe, Good, good Old Joe is back, I love it. She gets, um, um, L L Lapita, was that Hector's little sister, Lapita? Yeah, I, I, yeah, I, yeah, yeah, I, I think that's her name, uh, Lapita, she, she, she even gets Hector, she gets Sunday, I think that was his girlfriend's name, Hector, remember Hector's, um, introduction when he was introduced in season three, uh, in, in, in the junkyard, in the, in the um, um, in the, in the 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 metal scrap yard. Um, at, at the, his girlfriend was also introduced. I think her name is Sunday. I might be wrong. It comes below. Is it Sunday or Sunny? I think it's Sunday. But anyway, um, so she gets you know Sunday. Um, they they get those two neighbors that were like making fun of not really making fun of Nancy, but just telling her and telling her out of this. Like you're not gonna be able to fix this hole. He's the same guy who was drinking that corn juice. Ew! I'm soaking. Um, like throw up nightmares about that Ugh. Uh, oh oh jeez oh man <sighs> sorry about that <laughs> okay oh jeez like uh, getting a reflex um just that's just, just so gross anyway um but but they're, they're here to help too so they're all gonna help i'm, I'm like okay that's interesting i mean well I, i'm with bill like do they have any farming experience and bill just says how it is like N nancy I, I need to come over here it's okay and he, he just grabs the yangster and i would um sorry pants um 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 i would like uh, I would t usually take a point off it's like okay bill you're getting way too pushy but this is supposed to represent bill at, like, you know, kind of, I don't want to say, like, going down with madness or, or anything like that, because I kind of use that a lot with a lot of characters, but Bill is trying his best to keep it together, but since he's losing his farm, and, like, this is everything he worked for, this is, like, like his baby, like, this is, like, just everything in this whole plot line about uh, uh, Bill losing the farm, now he got it back, he, like, his family is back in the country, this is where he belongs, this is where its roots is, that, like, that this is where he belongs, this is who he is, this, this is in his blood, and now he, he has a threat that's taking it away again, first it was the, 
um, it was the, um, I forgot what they're called, the corporation, but, like, the tech farmers, basically, um, there was, like, the first threat, and now the bunnies are now new threat, he doesn't want anything bad to happen, it's too good to see in his face, so, Bill kind of yanking Nancy, is a little rough, yes, but it's in character with Bill kind of, again, I don't want to say coming to, to madness or anything, to going down with the madness, but, you can say it if you want, but, it makes sense with this character, it, it does, and he's like, um, Bill, out, like, sorry, Nancy, but, seriously, we gotta talk, like, these people, is it Nancy, I got the bet, I think if we is I think if we play with everyone's strengths, I think we have a shot here. And Bill, Bill says, Nancy, I appreciate this. I'm glad that you're here. Seriously, I'm glad you're here. But I'm the leader. I'm calling the shots. Like I understand. And Nancy's like, okay. I like how Nancy didn't like disagree. She's like, you just you're a farm. You're a farmer. You're, you're the lead farmer. You've been doing this longer than I have. You're the leader. Sure. Okay. I'm not gonna. I, I like how Nancy. Like, I'm just here to pitch in. I'm just here to help you raise the kids. Along with you and Alice and um, I, like, like you know, and I'm just here to help out. I, I love the, you know, being with you and the kids and with the family, being part of the family. But I don't want to step on, on, on any toes. But Nancy isn't also afraid to speak her mind. And I just love Nancy. She's my favorite adult character. I love her so much. <laughs> um, um, let's see. For a while it was Gloria, but now, now it's Nancy. I, I love Nancy. Um, let's see. Um, so, and, so, and it's like, okay, Bill, you're in charge. And, but, but I, um, and, and Bill's, Bill's just like, like, Nancy, I, I understand, like, you, you want everyone, like, to, to help, but other than good old Joe, none of these are real farmers. And then Nancy's like, well, you're in charge, but I just think if we just all work together, we have a good conversation, I think we can all put it together. And, and Nancy, I appreciate the advice, but I got it. Just, like you, I forgot the task that he got her. It was a while since I've seen the episode, the, the, the rewatch. What? Oh, right, right, right. Um, Bill said that for Nancy to get like a t type of component to to like attach to this machine to, to help pick out the carrots because the bunnies are gonna go after them soon. So Nancy needs to get that like that the, the contraption, whatever it's called, um, working again. So that. Yeah, that that was Nancy's job. I was kind of trying to figure like, what was her job again? <laughs> that was the job. And I, and then I look up. I was like, okay, Bill, you got your you got your work cut out for you. Time to whip these non-farmers into shape. And then everyone's just having a good time and having fun. But Nancy is like, I got help, and everyone's willing to help. But everyone's just kind of goofing off. I'm like, okay, well, well what's gonna happen? And then Bill's like, he just signs everyone jobs. He signs um. Cricket and Remy to wash and lettuce. He signs. He said like Ma and Patty. Let's so Alice and Patty. Um, Bunny Patrol. And I like how Tilly kind of puts herself on Bunny Patrol. Um, she, she did, but she didn't. But basically, like, oh, Alice and Patty's like we're gonna like those bunnies won't know what hit them. And then Tilly's like, not that I will. Not with me in the way that she's kind of saying to herself and like kind of she's saying it out loud, but kind of in a whisper. But it's basically. I was like, at the moment, it was kind of like, okay, Tilly, what are you going to do? Like, are you going to mess up the farm and it's going to be kind of your fault, but no one's going to blame Tilly because she's, like, saving the bunnies? Or is Tilly just going to rescue the bunnies, but she's still going to help out on the farm? Like, what path is she going to take? And I shouldn't really doubt Tilly. I guess I'm still kind of mad with the whole mole thing. If you've been on my channel long enough, you know what I'm talking about. I'm not going to get into the whole mole fiasco of her going back and forth and not knowing that Bill takes care of the moles on the farm i'm not gonna get into a conversation for some reason that she knew and then she magically had character amnesia and didn't know for some reason i don't i don't understand that i don't understand why the directors went with that route of the, with the character amnesia i think that's the biggest character of be betrayal that, that any person can do like whatever your character knows should know unless you make it a, 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 um an important part in the episode where they lose a memory like, or have amnesia, or, like, a memory wipe device. And it's, okay, that, that makes sense why they would forget. Not because we, we we forgot about it also. Like, no. I, I, I really hate that. But we're not here to talk about Tilly with that. But I, I really, I, other than that whole fiasco thing from a long time ago, season two, um, it's season one, um, I usually really have more faith with Tilly and with animals. And that she wouldn't like, you know, save animals over the farm, but, like, I, 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 sh I, I really shouldn't have had, like, doubted Tilly, but for some reason I did, I probably was thinking about the moles at the time, but, anyway, so, that, that was my bad, 
I should have had faith in Tully. But you're going to tell you that it, like, I, I'm going to save those bunnies because Alice and Pirate can like, kill them. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm going to tell you, like, the bunnies don't have to die. Like, jeez. Um, but, um, let, let's see. And, 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 and Bill's just saying everyone else, you know, jobs and stuff. Um, and say, okay, everyone, you get to work. And then, like, you know, uh, and everyone's just kind of, oh, I, I, um, Lapita is asking, uh, oh, Mr. Green, Mr. Green, like, oh, yes, sweetie, like, what can I do? And I love little Peter wants to help. She isn't like a kid that I just want to goof off with Cricket and Tilly and Remy. And, and no, she wants to help. And, and um, he's like, oh, I'm sorry, sweet, but you're just too young for this. I wonder what Bill's age requirement is for helping out on the farm. Because Remy is 10, Cricket is 11, and Tilly's 12, so... Is Lupita eight, seven, is it seven or eight? Is, is that too young? Uh, farmers in the comments, um, is seven and eight. If that is Lupita's age, we don't we don't have the exact age for her. I don't think I I I, I don't think we in the show, and I'm not sure they ever said her age or anything. I know she's younger than Cricket and Remy and Tilly, but I'm not sure her age is. So seven and eight is that too young to work on a farm? Comes below. Um. Let's see. Uh, let's see. Um, what else? I mean, what else? What's next? Um, right. So, so Lupita, you're just too young to work in the farm, and she said, "I want to help." Like, I'm sorry, you just, you just can't. And Lupita's all being all grouchy, but she's like, "Okay, I guess this, I'm just gonna be bored here." And then everyone's just kind of, kind of goofing off. It was I forgot their names, but. The, uh, what was it, Tyler? The, the husband's name? I don't know. I'm not sure. But, um, do you, uh, I'm not sure exactly what this is, and I don't really care. I, I don't want to say I don't care to, because, again, I'm not sure exactly what it is, but Tyler, I'm just going to call him that. Was it, was it Randall? I, I'm not sure. But the, those purple the people, they were kind of talking about how, um, he has people to pay him, like, to not work on his farm, I, I'm not sure if I want to know what's going on there, but because they don't explain what that is. And then Bill's like, I need you guys to work hard. And then she's like, are you saying my Randall isn't a hard worker? And she's like, he's like, yeah, I would work on my farm. I would work more on my farm if those agencies uh, w w would stop like paying me to like not work on it. And I'm like, w what is that? I never heard of that. Like there's, there's corporations that pay you to not work on your farm. The, but how do you get money unless he has a different job? But why would... I probably shouldn't think about this too hard. I probably shouldn't. For my own good, I probably shouldn't. But I, I don't I don't understand how you get paid for pharma corporations that pay you money, their money, to not work on the farm. Do the corporations work on the farm? But why would they want to do that? And what do they get out of it? Like another nice farm? Like we never seen their farm. Is it really nice? Like is it like a rich farm or something? I don't. I'm. I'm. I don't. I don't know. I did the, the first time watching in the rewatch. Definitely in the rewatch. I was trying to think about it a little bit like harder just to figure out what that is. And I, I'm just a little too afraid to go on Google like what that is. And like and like type in, um. And again, I guess like a little warning, like for anyone else, because again, I don't know what this is. I don't know. I'm not sure if it's dangerous or not. I can maybe I'm just overreacting. I probably am. But like you know, pe you know, like you know, kids that like you're under the age, like like you know, twenty one. You know, uh, please be wary for anything that, that that like you might search up, especially something that you don't understand. Because like heck, I don't understand it. <laughs> but apparently, he gets paid by corporations for not working on his farm. For some reason, again, I don't know, but anyway, um, and, and uh, um, basically he's saying like you know, we're working on your stuff, and um, he uh they're they're picking uh, they're picking um cabbages, and he like smashes one um with his head, and he got knocked out. Um, so meanwhile, Cricket and Remy are playing wa like a water fight with the hoses. And he's like, you kids should be working. And Kirk's like, oh, yeah, sorry, Dad. We got to start. And like, you know you can't trust me with a hose. But Bill doesn't have any time for, like, trust with jobs, really. 
And since this is like a simple job for Cricket and Remy, he has to trust his son uh, with his son with the hose because, um, with the water hose, um, because um, the the bunnies are coming, and like, he just has to do it. And uh, she and, and then and so speaking of kids, Lupita, what are you doing? And Lupita is distracting good old Joe from his work. And I guess she's not doing really anything bad, but she's just so bored. And again, she would totally help out if you just give her a job. But Bill's stubborn. He's not going to do that. And Lupita's too young. Again, I'm not sure what the age um, the, the age limit for working working on the farm is. I don't know. But she's like, go to Joe. The, 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 see me do a cartwheel. Okay. He's, the go to Joe wants to support her. Okay, sure. <laughs> go to Joe. Check, check me out dancing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this, is a little, this is a little film version of her dancing. And then you go to Joe's like, wow. I love go to, I love go to Joe. It's like okay, Lupita, let go to Joe work, and then she's she's okay. That's totally fine. I don't even mind like stopping dancing, but please, like Mr. Green, I want to help. Please give me a job. <laughs> oh my goodness, the kid's begging for a job, and then she says, I'm sorry, you're just, you're just too young. And Bill's not even like saying I I like, I don't trust you with work or or anything. Like like you, like he said, like, there's just like an age limit, and you just can't work on the farm. And he just is just that's just how it is. That hmm. And the little piece is, oh, man, what what am I supposed to do here? But she stops from distracting good old Joe because she knows like like she can't do that or otherwise Bill's just gonna go tell her to stop again. So she just goes off somewhere else. I'm not sure exactly where she went. She just went off somewhere. Um but the good old Joe went went back to work. Uh I didn't really like this with um Sonny and um I almost called him Hank for a second. <laughs> um, uh, not, not Henry. Um, Hector. Okay, I knew I knew it started with an H. I'm like, what was it again? Hector. I, I didn't like this whole thing about like, oh, adults are dumb and teenagers are not understandable. I, I, again, I'm not a teenager anymore. I, I, I'm 20, but... I, I, it, it, it just seemed um like uh, he's like you you guys I didn't sign you this job to not to make Google eyes at each other you guys need to be working because the planes are gonna come I one hundred percent agree with Bill on this is it but is it just because I'm a, I'm an adult and not a teenager is that why who knows <laughs> in the comments below agree or disagree with me but um and they're like uh okay and they kind of give like a sarcastic kind of look like you're the ones who came to help Nancy asked you guys to help with the bunny problem. And Drew kind of like, and I'm like, uh, 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 <laughs> oh, jeez. Like, I, I, I guess maybe I should give them a little slack. They're teenagers. I'm not going to take a point off or anything, but I'm like, Nancy has you guys to help with the bunny issue, not to make Google Goo high stage. I'm not saying you can't do both, but you guys are not working. And then Bill gets embarrassed like, 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 a, like a dumb old man, and he's like, oh, I'm sorry, I'm dumb. I'm sorry, I, I just do whatever you want. And even Bill says, wait a minute, I'm not sorry. Like, how do teenagers do that? I'm like, do what? Be sarcastic at me, put your foot down, and just tell them, hey, like, the, my, my ex-wife, <laughs> um, that Miss Green, like Nancy, asked you guys to help out with the bunny problem. If if you guys are not suitable, this I can give you another job. But you guys really need to work. And if you're gonna give the, that attitude, then maybe we should have like another discussion about it. Not like fully lead, lead, land the iron fist because again, that that causes problems between parents and ad adult figures and teenagers. That causes problems just laying down the full iron fist. But you need to have a discussion with Hector and Sunday. Not. Being like a um like a like a full rage monster, but also not being a full bumbling moron. Because even Bill realized like, we what am what am I talking about? Not sorry, but you all mentioned like 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 teenagers have like a superpower or something. I personally never, I didn't do this. At least I don't remember uh, doing this. But again, I took a point off for that because I'm like that was just super weird. Whatever. <laughs> again, maybe a couple of years ago, uh, if I saw this episode, maybe I. Wouldn't have taken a point off because I would still be a teenager. Who knows? I don't know. <laughs> um, but anyway, uh, me meanwhile, let's get back. Um, I forgot like the the plot points in order, but let's see. Um, there's a plot point with um Bill and Nancy. There's a plot point with the the purple people again, Randall and his wife. There's a plot point with um Lupita. 
I guess it's going to say Lupina and Good Old Joe is kind of the same plot point, kind of. Um, Crooked and Remy, uh, Tilly, Alice and Patty, and um, Dwayne. So, seven? I, 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 hmm. Wait, you know what? Scrap that, actually. So, I, I guess, like, the main plot points um, that, that I would say would be Bill trying to save his farm, um, Nancy becoming, spoilers in the episode, Nancy becoming a leader later in the episode, so that's another plot point. Tilly trying to save the bunnies, um, let's see, a Lupita, I won't spoil that when it comes later, but Lupita, and that's it, right? I would say like it's like those four main plot points. Because even with Cricket and Remy, it's not really like a plot point or anything. It's just kisses goofing off and then they, they, they like, you know, again, I won't spoil it, spoil it, but they basically have to like win something to, you know, like do the work, basically. There's just like a prize involved. So there's just four plot points. So A plot, B plot, C plot, and D plot, which basically Greens is pretty good with doing. But um, we get with Tilly's plot point, and then Alice and Patty are just going to have different tactics of catching the bunnies. And then, you know, Patty has the tactical version of, like, you know, doing a cage and, and luring with the carrot. And then Alice says, I have dynamite. She, she's ready to plunge, baby. The shit is boom. And, and then, <laughs> um, and, and uh, basically, uh, the, the bunnies have to get the bait. And, and then I was like, drop it now. And then she's dro dropping like a, what was it, like a rock? It wasn't an anvil. I think it was a rock. And then Tilly's like, meep, meep, like, like Roadrunner, and just grabs the bunny and just boom, they, they gets out of there. And they're like, and then Bill's like, Ma, Patty, what are you doing? We know, look out. And then, the, 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 the whole, and like, what was that? And then, um, I was like, dynamite to catch the bunnies. And Bill just doesn't want to argue. Just go catch the bunnies, please. And they're like, okay. Um, let's see. Um, let's see. We talked about good old Joe. We talked about Lapita. We talked about Cricket and Remy watching the less. They're, they're getting distracted. Sunday and Hector. Alice. Um, Patty and Tilly. Um, oh, right. The, the, um, the, the purple people, um, Randall and his wife. Um, uh, what happens? Next? Oh, right. So, so everyone's just like not focusing and everything. I, everyone's just kind of goofing off again. And then Bill's like, Nancy, come here. It's like, oh, okay. Like, hey, Bill, what, what's, happen what's happening? It's like, I, I, like, you know, I'm not really finding that piece, but I'm still working on it. Oh, that's great, Nancy. I, I knew it can c count on you. But. I, like I, you just need to tell everyone to leave. Like, I, you know, I'll do it. Like everyone, thank you. Your service is no longer required. And they're kind of like, wait, what? And they're someone even kind of leaving, just kind of like, wait, like, because they kind of want to do work, but they also kind of don't. They're kind of wishy washy. And then Nancy, wait, no, everyone, don't go anywhere. Bill, can I see you? And Nancy kind of does the same thing to Bill, kind of like tugs him along, not as forceful as Bill. Does Bill come over? Bill, what's the issue? And it's like. Nancy, these non-farmers, they're not working out. Everyone's just goofing off. And then Nancy's like, maybe if you would actually get, get to everyone's strengths and use them, like, you know, to actually get them to work. And, and then Bill said, like, like, you know, I, like, no one's listening to me. It's because you're not, you, you're not, you're not being a leader. Like, you're just being a boss. And, and then um, Bill basically, and Nancy kind of go into a little argument. And then Nancy's like, Bill. Why are you overreacting? Why? What? What's so important? Like, why are you freaking out? And then Bill is basically like, I can't lose this farm again. And, and he just says it loudly. Everyone's like, oh. <laughs> everyone's just in the background. They're like, oh, that's why you're so hard on us. It's like that moment. And then Nancy's like, oh, Bill, because Nancy was his wife, and Nancy's probably the, the closest friend other than good old Joe that um, Bill has, and vice versa to Nancy. Like, even while them this being divorced, they have, like, a, a a third child and Gloria. I mean, they're, like, they're a team. And so, they, they know about each other's ups and downs and what they've been through. And stuff. But they met, they met each other when they were kids. So, they even have that connection. So, Nancy's like, oh, Bill. Nancy, Nancy knows. Oh, I, I love her so much. I love her. <laughs> but, um, and Nancy's like, oh, Bill. 
and um, like you know, uh, I build it. I have to. I I can't lose my, my legacy again. You know, talking about losing legacy. I can't lose my legacy. I, I can't lose my farm again. I I can't lose this part of my family. I I have to make sure that nothing bad happens to it. And, and then Nancy's like, Bill, you have to listen to me. It doesn't have to be all on you. Even Nancy mentions like, Na Bill, I I feel I feel. It is partially my fault. It's because you feel like you have to put everything on yourself. And I, I even have to have to tell Nancy, like Nancy, this isn't mainly your fault because Bill has been feeling that, like this since, since like a kid. Because this whole farm thing about losing the farm has been happening since um he was a kid. Because we actually learned about that. I, I was called Green Acres when we actually meet Nancy for the first time. Well, not for the first time, uh, when Bill and Nancy meet for the first time when they were kids, and we actually even get to meet Nancy's dad. Um, not mom. We don't, we're not sure what happened to her. Um, maybe she passed away. Because around the same like time, Bill's father passed away. So, who knows? Um, but so, what was, what was I talking about? Oh, right. So, yeah, Bill's been a hand, trying to handle this since he was a kid. And, um, but, but like, you know, and Nancy basically mentioned, like, Bill, I feel this is partially my fault. You, you had to put everything on yourself. Because I know I wasn't around much. But I am now... And I'm trying to put my best foot forward. I'm trying to be with you guys. I made a mistake, but now I'm back and I want to help. All of us want to help, but more, more, more or less. I, but like, all of us want to help. But Bill, like, you have to try something different. You can't just do the same old thing. You have to listen to others. And again, I love Nancy. Nancy's not being overbearing. She's not saying, oh, Bill, like, you're an idiot or anything, or you're, you're a dumb old man. You should listen to me because I'm the cool mom or something. No, she says it how it is. She said she apologizes for not being here before, and, and uh, even Nancy kind of blames herself, even though that that wasn't necessary. She even like and that's part of her character too. Um, like, we're, we're, like Nancy was kind of talking about that, and, and like you know, um, and everyone's kind of they kind of wondering like, oh, well, what's gonna happen now, and Bill, uh, uh, uh oh, um, I, I forgot there was another plot point with um. Uh, oh, there was like a joke. I, I, I forgot to mention it about this. It, 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 it slipped my mind. Um, but <laughs> Tilly released all the bunnies in the forest. If you if you know what happens, and Patty and Alice are like, Tilly, are you insane? Like, what are you talking about? I, I, I let them loose from the from the likes of you. I, I helped them escape. Don't you know what bunnies do in the forest? What do you mean? And you just hear a big rumbling, and they're like, Oh no, they multiplied. And it's like a joke. That bunnies, and this is a real life thing, uh, where bunnies produce a bunch of, like, you know, like, a, I'm not sure if it's called a litter. There's some species that produce a litter. I'm not sure if that's what was called for bunnies. Is it? Bunny experts. Is, is that what it's called, like, a bunch of baby bunnies? Is it called a litter? It might be. Who knows? Um, but there's a bunch of litter of bunnies, and um, there's, like, a joke that, that they do produce a lot, a lot of bunnies. And they do. Not that much but again it's part of the joke i i laughed it was like a chuckle to a laugh i had a good time that's i'm not gonna take a point out for that like technicality it is it's not that many bunnies I, I i had a good time with it so i'm cool with it um and um let's see so they're coming and uh basically um but before hold the whole speech thing tilly alice and patty were kind of talking to um oh no no it was actually after the speech tilly patty and Alice actually finally arrived and saying, Oh, Tilly, what, what's wrong? Why are you out of breath? Like, bunnies in the woods. They, they multiplied. And they're like, Oh, no. And then uh, Nancy's like, Okay, Bill. Like, like you know, I, I, like, um, you're, you're in charge. What do we do? And then Bill's like, hey, Even Bill's kind of struggling with it, but Bill knows this is the right thing to do. I love it. And I like these Bill moments that, like, he admits that he's wrong. And like he works on himself, and not just be uh, not being an overbearing parent or being a crybaby, he's like, okay, we're gonna we're gonna do something different. Nancy, you're in charge. And then Nancy just like doesn't like say, like, you know, she just gives like a smile, like, just a nice, genuine smile. She's like, okay, thank you, Bill. It kind of like a like a look. Like, I won't let you down. I, I love it. <laughs> oh my goodness, I love I love this episode. Um. I just like in my heart, not an actual like review. I was saying at the end, um, but but I, in my heart, oh, I love this episode, love it. And it's like, like okay, Billy, like I won't let you down. It's okay, everyone. 
I'm splitting off to, in, into teams. Tilly, you're on Bunny Patrol. Like, will, wait, wait, are you sure? Is it trust me, Bill? The Tilly's on Bunny Patrol. He's like, okay, I trust you. And he's like, okay, um, um, let's see. I'm, I'm trying to remember the jobs. Um, she she mentions um Lapita. Like, I'm gonna give you a job, and she's like, oh, wait, I, I'm useful. I get a job. And, and it, Bill, not at any point, was trying to tell Lapita. That, that you're useless in his way. He wasn't trying to do that. He just has like a whole age limit thing. That's all Bill's thing. Like he didn't want to say that Lapita was useless or anything, but um, that that was kind of what Lapita was kind of feeling, kind of not full blown, but kind of like, wait, I'm useful. <laughs> and so like, yeah, I need you to go to the junkyard, and this is where she probably knows that like, in the back of her hand, but since her parents work there. Um, she would totally know. Like, I need you to get this specific part. I forgot what it's called. This specific part for our carrot contraction. Again, I forgot what it's called. The carrot tractor. And, and she's like, I gotta be part of something. So, the Lapita runs to the juncture. You need you need to hurry. Okay. Because Lapita's small. There, there isn't, the, the, like, you know, like a truck for her. She has to run because everyone else has jobs. So, no one's able to drive her. And, um, um, let, let's see. Um, oh, um, what was it? Randall and, um, Hector... Um, the, the, you need to, um, um, peel the, the, the cabbages. And, and, and the, the, even Hector's like, what? Because Hector and, and Sunday were separated. That was really smart and Nancy because they, yeah, they're just going to make a Google, Google eyes on each other. And it's like, Sunday, uh, how about, do we need some morale. How about you play some, uh, some music? That's pretty good because Sunday's thing is playing music. And we, 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 we would like need like a morale boost. And Patty, I need you to make some snacks for the team. And that's my specialty. And again, you know, Patty's the chef. And this thing is popping up again. Oh, my goodness. But, you know, I'm not, not going to let it get me upset. But, um, let's see. Uh, what else? Um, I forgot what Alice was doing. What, was she part of the cabbages also? I, I forget. Um, but, um... Let's see. And it's like, oh, and this is what I was talking about before doing what like the prize. So the cricket rhyme me, you get these temporary tattoos. Whoever can um wheelbarrow the cabbages into the barn like, the fastest. And he's like, Oh yeah, I, I can do it, I can do it. And, and obviously they have like a prize, a, a goal to do the work. And it's just, so they're not just gonna be goofing off, basically. And then it's like, okay, you build just help out as much as you can, and we're gonna do this. He's like, okay, Nancy, I trust you. And, and then late son is playing a song, and it's a really good song. I thought it was a little too on the nose that the bill, the you know, big song is like, oh, like don't weigh the whole burden on yourself and they like, have a helping hand. She's like, she's he's like, this song is a uh, really conveniently part of my situation. Like, yeah, Bill, we know. Like, I don't think he needed to say that. I I don't think it was funny either. I was kind of like, oh okay, like yeah, it was it's like a part of, like the oh it's on the nose like, like um man, man. I didn't hate it but eh, I, I I didn't like it. I didn't like it too much. I just felt like it was unnecessary. You could just had the song. You could have just had um, good old Joe like help Bill out with the cabbages, and then he and, and then they would just wheelbarrow the cabbages along, and then that was it. There was no need for dialogue, but they kind of want to make a funny joke out of it. But there was no need for that. But and and again, like yeah, everyone's kind of doing their jobs and stuff. Again, it was a whole teenage thing with Hector and Randall Reynolds trying trying to like say his, like, his whole job thing again. I don't I don't understand it about, about it one bit. But again, um, Hector was like, oh okay, the kind of the, does the thing. It does get Randall to start working again, so that tactic works. But I'm like, did he do that on purpose, or is it because he's an angsty teenager? Again, I don't get it. I don't I didn't like to do. It. I, I don't like the joke where he's like, "Oh, you're right. That this dumb. I'm sorry. It probably is dumb, but I I don't, I don't understand the job. But um, against the whole teenage thing, and I I just don't understand it. I'm not gonna take a, gonna take a point off again because I already did. <laughs> but I don't know. It happened again. Um, so so, so like you know, Tilly captures all the bunnies. And she's like, you're mine. You you're mine, cuties. And then you um do you have cricket and Remy kind of getting a little bit tired? Patty has cookies and cookies just energize the like, you know, young boys and the, and the, you're they're will bearing more care uh, the more cabbages and Sunday's finishing her song and boom they they hauled all the cabbages great and you know, and then the, the the bunnies just come out of the shed and they're gonna start attacking the carrots and they're attacking like the first like two rows is it. 
Nancy, you're in charge. What are we going to do? Oh, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Oh, where's Lupita? Because I think, what, they spent like 30 minutes doing the cabbages? I, I'm not sure how much, I don't know how much time has passed. But, um, but, uh, let's see. What happens next? Where Lupita finally comes. I, I, I have it, like, uh, like, I, I, and she even, like, fixed the tractor. I fixed the tractor. And they go, oh, great job, Lup Lupita's like, I'm useful. And then, like, young Bill just gets in there. And he's like, it's your, it's your job, lead farmer. And then and Bill's like, thank you, Nancy. And then uh, Bill gets in the tra tractor. And he just hauls all the carrots and stuff. And it's done. And the bunnies with no food, they just run away into back in the forest. Probably making more babies. Who knows? Or... Attacking, or probably attacking another farm. Oh, jeez. Hopefully it's not one of the farmers that, that were helping us out. Like, oh, jeez, their farms are going to get intact. At least they have, they have, like, a security system, like a scarecrow or something. I don't know. Or barbed wire or something. Who knows? But, um, yeah, they, they hauled all the carrots and stuff. It was like, at, at, and Bill says, hey, everyone, thank you for coming. I know it's harsh. But I really appreciate everyone, like, you know, coming out. And it's, yeah, no no problem, Bill, like, any time. And then Bill and Nancy have, like, a good moment. So, hey, Nancy, I'm a great farmer, but you are a great leader. We could have made this, made this out without you. I really appreciate you, Nancy. Thank you for coming through. And thank you for being with us now, nowadays. And Nancy's like, Bill, I really appreciate you saying that. And I'm glad to be here, too. And I'm glad I was able to help out. And you did a great job too. You're and you're doing great with this farm. Thanks, Nancy. And they clink drinks, and they do, they're having like strawberry lemonade. I think delicious. I, I love strawberry lemonade. Um, and and you you're just drinking, and you're just having like a good time, and and that's basically where the episode ends. Um, seventy five percent. I thought this was a good episode. C plus. I it's not as good as Chill Bill. I thought that was just a great episode, but. Again, like, if you just ask me, like, in my heart what I thought this episode, I just don't no score for it, but I just loved it. I love the moment between Bill and Nancy, but it doesn't, like, you know, um, it, it's not enough for me to, like, you know, to ignore, ignore the flaws and stuff. And that was the whole thing with uh, the whole teenage thing. And, um, let's see. What was it? What was the other things? Uh, the teenage thing. Oh, the song that, like, like, you know, corresponds with my situation. I thought that was too on the nose. Um, let's see. Um, oh, did another. I, I, I totally, I kind of blocked this out of my head because I, I, I totally forgot about it. There was a whole thing with Dwayne being afraid of rabbits. And again, it happened like twice, uh, three times in the episode. But I just completely forgotten about it because I don't like it too much because Nancy asks, okay, we have a bunny situation, we need your help, and Dwayne came anyway, even though he said, I have a crippling fear of rabbits, if this was like an arc for him to get over his fear of rabbits, but he didn't say that, he just came anyway, oh, there's even like a moment where everyone like arrived, Dwayne has head out, and he has tongue sticking out like a dog, like, is this supposed to say like, Patty owns Dwayne, I, I didn't like that, so, the, the, for those reasons, I give it like a 75%, again, there weren't like a big moments, I love the moments between Bill and Nancy. I love them. But it was just for those reasons, 75%. It was still a good episode, but those same things kind of bother me for me to just ignore them. But yeah, I thought this was a good episode. So overall, let's see. Seventy-seven point five percent. So C plus. I thought this was you know, episode nineteen, um, your know, chill bill slash um bunny farm. I thought it was a seventy-seven point five. I thought this was a C plus. I thought it was a good episode. First half, eighty percent. Second half, seventy-five percent. Overall, seventy-seven point five percent. Yep, C plus. Thought this was a good episode. And um, yeah. Um, so, so you know, once again, thank you so much to my um, one hundred and. 97th subscriber I really appreciate you guys I really appreciate all you guys and hopefully I, oh, I will reach hopefully I will reach 200 before September since we're technically in August hopefully I will reach then before September and hopefully we'll, we will reach 200 and hmm, so, oh right so um 
everyone, um, you know, in the comments below, what did you think of this episode? And everyone, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell, give me a big thumbs up, leave a comment down below, don't forget to share the video, don't forget to, um, don't forget to check out my mini, mini reviews and my community posts, and, um, I will see you guys tomorrow, well, I'll definitely see you guys tomorrow for my, um, big review for the, the season 3 finale of Big City Green Season 3, Episode 20, and it's called Long Goodbye. <sighs> yep, we're finally, you had Long Goodbye, and it's going to be a double episode too, and I think I have, like, the full episode. I, I, I have to double check, but I'm pretty sure I have it, so... It will not have had it on the Disney Channel app, but you know, you know what I mean. But yeah, so that full review is gonna definitely gonna come tomorrow. Uh, um, I'm not sure about the mini review. Is this gonna come out later today or um before the big review? That's gonna come out tomorrow and hopefully the same day. Um, Saturday, I'll also put my community post. So all that for season three that could be you know finally finally completed. Like the the, the journey is finally coming to a close, and yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow for that. Okay. Bye.